The Salvation Army Women's Auxiliary is getting ready for their artistry of tables and fashion show and luncheon. And joining us now with more on the event is Major Army Reardon of the uh, Salvation Army. Good to see you, Major. Great nice for, uh, thanks for coming by. Thank you for inviting me. This sounds terrific. <laughs> Let's first talk about the, artist, the artistry of tables, and then we'll get into the fashion show. What is that? Well, it's called artistry of tables because all of the tables have been decorated by the Women's Auxiliary members, right. and they really go whole, whole hogs, so it'll be quite a big deal. Yeah. And then there will be the fashion show that goes with it, and the luncheon, and a guest speaker. It's going to be a great event. I'm picturing a big room with a lot of amazing looking tables, and then what, the models will come out and, and show off some fashion? That's exactly it. They'll yeah. show off fashions that come from our family store, and then we will have items on sale from our family store, accessories and clothing. And as I think I mentioned, all the models are residents of our rehabilitation program. Tell me a little bit about that program, because that's uh, something real special. Yeah, that program, uh, we had our main rehab center rebuilt, and it opened, I think, in 2020. And since that time, it's uh, that's in Otay Mesa, and since that time, over 250 people have graduated and are living a sober life, Great. thanks to the program. And so we even have a speaker coming for the Artistry of Tables, who is a program graduate, and she works at the women's residence of our program, and she has been saved from alcohol and drug addiction. Yeah. So. Can you share her story? story a little bit? Her name is Alma Lopez. I haven't heard her story yet, so I'm right. looking forward to hearing it myself. I'm new in the area, so I... Oh, terrific. Yeah. How, how does it work? Somebody is going through some issues, and then they, they, they kind of sign up for the program, and then they're, they're put through kind of, what, a certain number of days or weeks or so? It's an amazing program. It's a six-month live-in program, and there's a work therapy element to it, but it's completely free. All you have to do is come 24 hours detoxed, and you can have a bed if there's space there. There's a house for men and there's a house for women, and you're there for six months, and you really can get on your feet and start your new life. And you do some work, what, around the area there? Might work uh, at, usually at the thrift store, at the All family right. store, that kind of thing. Um, and that's how, you know, they get themselves sure. going, and they, get, they learn how to really be on a regular working schedule and how to just organize life. And know, food's provided and kind of everything's handled. Everything, yeah. That's what wonderful. makes it easier, right? I mean, you just go there and you can work and you eat and you make some friends and just don't drink or do drugs. That's right, and you have to attend AA, AA meetings yeah. and Bible studies and things like that, so. Well, that's terrific. So let's talk a little bit more about the event. Who can go? Are there tickets available? How does it work? There are about 30 tickets left. Anybody can go. It's a wonderful thing. It's at, um, it's at the Croc Center on University City Avenue. Great. And so I believe that our uh, phone number will appear on the screen and people can call if they're interested in a, in a sure. ticket. Sure. Well, we'll so put it on our website too at KUSI.com. <laughs> I don't see it coming up on the screen, but we'll of course get it. Thank and you. Um, I, so the, the women are wearing fashions from the store. So is, right. it, is it kind of everything from kind of glamour to maybe just fun workout, casual, things like that? I think it'll be a, a variety. I have yet to see. I'm excited about it. Yeah. Uh, but we do try to kind of show some of our nicer things that, that right. are donated and uh, that'll well, be Well, that can watch. help too. I mean, people can, people can go and spend the money on the ticket, which would help your organization or they can donate clothes or they can even just donate financially. That always helps too. Absolutely. But but sometimes the, um, the more business um, attire helps for somebody maybe who doesn't have it and they need it for a job interview to get that job. Oh, that's right. And that's yeah. available certainly. And with people who are residents in the program, they're provided with bus business clothes. Right. Well. Got to look sharp. Got to feel sharp. Got to look good. Well, there you go. All right, Major uh, Amy Reardon. Great to see you. Thank you With so much. With the Salvation Army. Thank all you. right. Uh, all the best on the uh, fun event. All right.